arrow guys you can see that there is there is a spiral stair and today i am going to show you how to draw this spiral spiral stair in solidworks so let's begin at first click here and select part and then click ok now go to sketch and select top plane and click on sketch now go to circle and select circle and then draw one circle and then another circle so go to smart dimension and take it okay uh to the dimension at first make it cds centimeter ground second okay now go to smart dimension and take it okay. sketch a uh, smart dimension and make it okay double click make it 100 cm and for the inner one okay again select this one for the inner one make it 20 cm okay now from here select center line and from the center draw a center line now draw a line now select mirror entities and entities to mirror so select this one at first now mirror about so click this one and select this one okay select this one okay now go to smart dimension and make the angle between this line and the center line is 15 degree okay okay now click on trim entities a trim this outer circle now trim the inner parts and also this inner part okay now go to features and click on click on extrude boss of base and make this one 5 cm so this i is 5 cm now click on okay now select front plane and sketch now click on space bar and click on normal plane okay now click on uh, center line again and from this edge draw a vertical center line select okay now again select line and from this point draw one line vertical one then horizontal again vertical again horizontal again vertical horizontal and join these two points okay now select this line press on control now select the upper one and make them equal okay now go to smart dimension now make this one 8 cm okay enter and make this one 3 cm enter now this one is automatically adjusted okay now select sketch fillet and make this one 1 cm and click this edge yes and also this edge yes and click on okay okay 
now go to features and click on revolve boss or base it is 360 degree blind and okay now select linear pattern and at first select direction direction one so for this one click here okay now this will be eight centimeter distance and this also eight centimeter eight parameters number eight and select features and faces so select this one okay now select okay I can check this one. Now select top plane sketch. Now click on spacebar and click on normal tool. Now select circle and from the center draw a circle. Okay. Now go to features. And from curves, select helix and spiral. And it will be pitch and revolution, constant pitch, and pitch will be 20 centimeter. Okay. And the revolution will be actually 9.25. Revolution will be 9.25, and start angle will be. It will be 45 degree angle. It will be clockwise. Okay. Now check this one. Okay. Now. Just click here and select sketch for it means that the circle is selected and now go to surfaces and select extruded surface and make this one 190 centimeter okay now good features and from here select okay from here select curve drive-in pattern and direction one at first so for this one select the helix and spiral and it will be transform curve also uh, here tangent curve and I need to select the body Select this one and okay. Now solid bodies and select L pattern one. So it is selected and face normal. So select this face. Okay. So you can see that our stair is almost almost ready. Now just we need some modification. Now just select the spiral and hide this one. Okay. Now just magnify and select the surface of the first one and click on sketch and click on spacebar and then click on normal tool. Okay. Then you will get a shape like this one top view. And then select circle and from the center draw a circle to the center of the center okay now uh, go to features now again from curve select helix and spiral again it is pitch and revolution Constant pitch and pitch will be 271 pitch 
and then a revolution will be 0.65 revolution and start angle will be 86 degree start angle and it will be counter clockwise okay okay now go to reference geometry select plane and for plane okay so you have got this plane okay now click on this plane and click on sketch now click on space bar and select normal tool let's magnify this one okay now from rectangle select center rectangle now from this point draw a center rectangle okay now from here select three point arc select this point this point okay okay now select three entities Now trim these parts. Okay, okay. Also trim this one. So trim these parts. Okay. Now go to features. Now click on switch boss or base. So select this one and for this one the line like this one okay now check our stair is ready now select the plane and hide the plane now you can check that our uh, stair is ready now we need to apply the material Now just apply the material and for this one select this one click on this one and select appearance just click here and select organic and then select wood we have various kinds of wood so we need to select one thus I am selecting oak And there are various types of oak, so I am selecting this one, polished Japanese oak. Click here. Okay. Now the material is applied. Now we can change the background. We can make the rooftop. Okay. This will look good. And we can make it perspective. Also we can hide this curve. Okay. Now you can see that the, our spiral stair is ready and hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and if you like this video make a comment and if you have any question also make comment. Thank you.